Hey guys, welcome to our 8th lesson of our certification training for the exam MO300, so Microsoft Office Specialist PowerPoint Associate 2019. And in today's lesson, we will start with a brand new chapter of our certification training, which is to manage slides. So we will cover 5 exam objectives today, insert slides, import Word document outlines, insert slides from another presentation, insert slides and select slide layouts, insert summary zoom slides, and duplicate slides. So let's start by importing Word document outlines. Yet I would like to firstly explain you how you can create such an outline. So I have prepared here a document and essentially what it allows you is that for example when you begin to plan your presentation you can write a simple outline of the ideas you want to cover in Word and then based on that you can create uh, or generate PowerPoint presentation and then elaborate on it. So to create uh, the title slide you have to use the title formatting so I'll just write title to create the slide with title and content you have to choose heading 1 for the title of such a slide so I'll write slide 2 then to create individual bullet points you have to use heading 2 and the other subsequent headings to create the more subsequent bullet points so let's just use heading 2 so point 1 point point 2 I have to format it with heading 2 and yeah let's just keep it like that let's save the file and let's start with the objective import Word document Word document outlines. So when you have the this, this slide selected it will create the new slides based on the outline after this slide or perhaps if you want to be precise you can always click here in between those two slides. So let's do that and to import our Word document outline we have to click new slides notice that I clicked at the bottom of this choice so new slides slice from outline our document PowerPoint can't open this file because it's used by because it's used so let's close the document and let's try that again slides from outline our document you can see that it is importing and when we continue yeah you can see we have our title and we have our slide 2 with individual points so that's how we import a word document from outline the next objective is to insert slides from another presentation for that still on the home tab we choose reuse slides and PowerPoint will recommend to you some presentations you have been working on currently so you might want to just click on that but in the exam setting you'll be most likely to browse for such a file so I have inserted here one of my presentations and then to insert the slides to the current presentation we can use just this button inside slide but you have also to be careful about whether you want to use the source formatting so when I insert the slide it will look like this or whether I want to use the the current formatting okay so for this purpose I want to keep the source formatting and I will insert the slide and it should be inserted after our slide 38 and perfect so that's how you reuse slides from another presentation okay, let's move on to another objective which is to insert slides and select slide layouts yes so this is relatively easy to insert new slides you click simply here on new slide or you have 
to sometimes choose a specific layout so be comfortable with looking at those names like that so when I'm required in the exam setting to insert after slide 42 the new slide with content with caption layout I click here and that's it also we can always change the layout, layout of the current slides so we click here layout and choose another layout like that so this is about inserting slides and selecting slide layouts and the, another objective is to insert summary zoom slides which is a new feature at least for the office 2019 or powerpoint 2019 so to insert summary zoom we go to the insert tab and here we have the zoom option summary zoom and it will create a new slide after this slide which it's kind of hard to explain it will insert the the looks of the slides you have selected and it will create some clever links and with that comes some animations features and so on but on the exam setting you are simply required to insert the summary zoom slide so we have clicked the zoom option on the insert tab and we have to choose which slides we want to insert so I might want to insert uh -huh, this slide, this slide, this slide, this slide, this slide, yeah and that's it and perfect as you can see PowerPoint has created the summary zoom for us and it's ready to go and the last objective the last objective is to duplicate slides and this is fairly straightforward so you simply right click on any slide that you that you want to duplicate and you choose the option to duplicate slide of course you could simply click ctrl c and ctrl v and it would create the same result so yeah yeah guys, thank you for watching today's video, I hope you find it valuable, if so smash that like button, support the channel, it really helps when you subscribe and I will see you in the next video, bye!